Hello and welcome to Entrance, a hypnotic meditation library which acts as a gateway to help you discover your deeper self. These recordings are of a hypnotic nature and should not be used while driving a car or operating machinery. Please use common sense and use only the appropriate Entrance volumes in appropriate places and environments to ensure safety. Please seek professional advice if you are receiving treatment for any clinically diagnosed disorder before using Entrance. Before we begin this journey deep into your subconscious mind, I want you to know that self-hypnosis, like all hypnosis, is voluntary. And if for any reason you want or need to become wide awake, you can do so easily and calmly at any point. Before we begin, you may wish to loosen any tight clothing or footwear. Entrance is produced to be listened to on stereo headphones. The Tones Library may be used on loudspeakers and in a quiet environment. You may wish to close your eyes for each session or fix a daydream stare on a comfortable spot in front of you until your eyes are closing. Whichever is the most comfortable for you to relax. Okay, make yourself comfortable. Place your arms comfortably at your sides, on the arms of the chair or on your lap. Close your eyes now. Take a deep breath in through your nose and slowly exhale all the air out of your mouth as you relax. Take another deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth as you relax even further. Continue breathing deeply, becoming more and more relaxed with each and every breath. And as you continue breathing deeply and relaxing more and more, we're going to go on a magical journey. And as you relax, I want you to imagine you're standing at the edge of a great pool of water. As you look down into the brilliant blue water, you get a feeling of peace and relaxation coming over your body. The water looks very inviting to you, and you have the powerful urge to place your feet into the pool. I'd like you to imagine placing your right foot into the pool. The water feels nice and warm as it covers your foot. Your foot is flooded with a warm, relaxing feeling. More relaxing than anything you've ever felt before. Now, place your left foot into the pool and it's met with an incredible warm relaxation as well. Now I want you to imagine that you start wading into the pool. At first, very slowly up to your knees. As you do this, the warm relaxation travels up your ankles and your calves, up to your knees. Just warm relaxation. And as you travel deeper now into the pool, there is no fear at all. Just the warm relaxation your body needs. It's like the pool is feeding your body with nourishment that it's always needed, but has until this moment been unable to find. So just relax. Relax. Up to your waist now. Feel the muscles letting go as the warm, relaxing water hits them. Slowly you travel deeper into the pool up to your belly now. You feel the muscles in your stomach and your lower back relax as you journey deeper and ever deeper up to your chest and upper back. 
relax, relax, and up to your shoulders, relax, relax. The water is now covering your entire body, up to your neck, with wonderful, relaxing warmth. There is no fear as you venture further into the pool. The water is slowly rising up to your chin as your face starts to relax into the magical warmth. You realize that you can breathe naturally while under this magical water and there is no fear at all as the water rises up past your cheeks and your nose. Relaxation takes over your body as you venture further in past your eyes. Relax. And up past your forehead. Just relax. Up past your scalp until your entire body is suspended in the wonderful, warm, relaxing water. Now as you're floating there in total relaxation, I want you to imagine a brilliant gold coin is shimmering at the bottom of the pool. And in a moment, I will begin counting backwards from 20 to 1. And as I do this, I want you to imagine drifting down deeper and deeper towards the bottom of the pool. And when you do this, you will feel no fear as you can breathe normally in this magic water. You will also feel no pressure at all, just an increased amount of peace and relaxation as you travel deeper and deeper into the pool. 20, deeper and deeper, 19, 18, 17, more and more relaxed as you go, 16, 15, you're getting closer and more relaxed with each count, 14, 13, 12, the coin is getting clearer and your body more relaxed the deeper you go, 11, 10, 9, as you get closer to the coin, you realize that it's attached to the lid of a large old wooden trunk, 8, 7, 6, deeper and more relaxed now, the coin is almost within your grasp, Five, four, three, even more relaxed, two, and one. As your hand reaches out to touch the coin, you feel more relaxation than you've ever felt before. As you gently pull on the coin in your mind's eye, I want you to imagine that the lid opens and a brilliant golden light pours out of the trunk. The light covers your entire body, making it even more relaxed. This golden light represents all of your potential in this life, all your creativity, all your strength, and all of your potential for good health, happiness, and prosperity. It's available to you now for the first time ever. And in this relaxed state of hypnosis, you're now able to draw from it, to change your life in positive ways you never dreamt possible. Now, I want you to imagine that you're in the foyer of a modern hotel. There are four elevators. 
you feel very drawn to one of the elevators, and suddenly you see its doors opening. I want you to go and get into that elevator and see that there are five levels of basement from B1 down to B5. I want you to press the button for B1 in your mind and go down to B1 and feel twice as relaxed as you already are. Go to B1 now. Good, that's right. Now I want you to go down to B2 deeper and deeper and more relaxed. That's right. And now, I want you to go down to B3. You're doing fine. And now down to B4. Total relaxation. In a moment, I'm going to ask you to go down to B5. And when I do that, I want you to see the doors open at B5. Now, Walk out of the elevator doors and look out into a magical garden. Take a look around and you can see a bench or a chair. Walk over to the bench or the chair and sit down. Gaze up into the sky and I want you to see the number 99 appear in the sky and fall to the ground which takes you deeper into hypnosis. And you can do that now. And I want you to see the number 85 appear in the sky and fall to the ground, taking you deeper again. And the next number that appears in the sky and falls to the ground, taking you deeper again, is the number 72. Deeper and more relaxed as the number 64 appears in the sky and falls, and even more relaxed. 53 takes you deeper and deeper. 41 rises and falls, and in 38, 27, 17, 9, and in 6. Five, three, two, and then the number one, absolutely perfectly relaxed now. Look around the garden and you will see a house in the garden. In your mind's eye, I want you to move to the front of that house and notice that it's open. See the sign above the door that says, all welcome. As you walk into the house, I want you to find a room with a table in it. On the table, you will notice a piece of rope with three large knots in. You look at the rope, and you see that any knot can be untied. Can it not? Yes, it will. Notice on the knots that there is a sign, a small message, which says stress and strain. Now, using the abundant power of your imagination, I want you to undo that knot. And the stress and the strain disappear. Now, I want you to move to the second knot and see the message on there, which says self-doubt. And I want you to untie that knot of self-doubt and go a little deeper. Now, looking at the third knot, see the sign which says self-doubt and anxiety. Now I want you to undo that knot and feel a little more relaxed in your mind. I want you to go outside of the house now and see a large hill behind the house. Go to the top of that hill. And now on the top of the hill, you will notice a gentle breeze as you look down. At the bottom of the hill, you see a stream, and the stream is blocked. The clear water running down from the hill into the stream is clogged up in a pond at the bottom, and is making the water dirty and unclear. I want you to take the path down the hill as I count back, and when I reach number one, you'll be at the clogged part of the stream, 
and ready to begin unclogging to make that stream run clear again. And 10. You begin to walk down the path. 9. 8. 7. The path gets a little thinner. And you can see the end. And also the number 6. 5. 4. There's a little twist in the path that turns nicely towards the blockage. And 3. 2. And 1. problems already, whilst, whilst there are, are many shades of grey, essentially, they are all either light or light. You will develop your own techniques of therapy without knowing you are developing them.
whenever you are in the presence of other people. And it doesn't matter whether it's a small group of people or a large group or whether they're friends or strangers. You will now learn to not have any fear of speaking in front of other people. You will always be able to express yourself easily and confidently. And you will learn to speak eloquently and confidently. With intelligence and humor when appropriate, your conversations will flow easily. And you will enjoy talking to people about any subject that arises. And now, you will always be able to meet people on equal terms, without the slightest feelings of inferiority. You will become so deeply interested, so deeply absorbed in what you're saying, that you become completely focused in the conversation to the complete exclusion of everything else. And so you always remain perfectly relaxed, perfectly calm and self-confident when you're speaking to other people, whether it's to do with business or pleasure, whether it's on a one-to-one -one or to a group and when you're with other people, you become much less conscious of yourself and your feelings. You will consequently be able to talk quite freely and naturally. If you should begin to think of yourself, you will immediately shift your attention back to your conversation. Remember, when you feel uncomfortable in company, this is caused by projecting. You are projecting your own thoughts onto other people. You are thinking that you know what they think. This is based on your own thinking. A negative way of thinking is unhealthy. Negativity never ends. Once one conclusion has been reached, another will open. Negativity needs to have the door closed on it. Of course, we need a level of self-criticism, but this should be positive reinforcement on the things you do well. But not everyone thinks the same. Some do. And some will think like you're thinking when you are uncomfortable. So remember, they too will project negativity onto people also. And when you're feeling uncomfortable, you can be sure you're not the only one. So next time you feel a twinge of anything negative, when you're in company, take a look around and ask yourself the question, who in front of me is feeling negative? And, whilst you do this, you will remain calm, confident, and self-assured at all times. And because of this, you will find that you get on better with people. You gain their respect easily, because you are a good listener. And. You speak with intelligence and confidence. And you like to laugh with people. As you know, it's a wonderful way to communicate. And this makes you feel happy and content. Knowing that you can communicate easily with people from all walks of life. As you draw upon your experiences of life to make your conversations interesting. And a 
as time goes by, you will find that you are enjoying being around other people. As your skills of communication grow more and more refined, and you draw opportunities toward you as people respond to your likable, easygoing personality. And so, as you grow more and more confident about your own abilities, when you're in the company of other people, you grow more confident about yourself and develop an inner calm and strength as the days and weeks and months go by. Now each of these ideas has made a vivid, deep and permanent impression on your subconscious mind. And each day in your daily life you become more and more aware of the full, powerful and creative expression of these ideas. It's time to come back to the present now, out of this deep relaxation. The subconscious mind will begin to transfer all of the beneficial new learnings that you've made to the conscious mind, the emotional mind, and the physical body. And as the unconscious mind now begins to start that transfer, I will begin to bring you back. In just a few moments, you're going to wake up I'm going to count from one to five. And at the count of five, you're going to come back to the here and now, feeling wide awake. Feeling wonderful in every way. Feeling so much calmer than before. One. Start to wake up and emerge from hypnosis. Two. Feeling wonderful, awake in every way. Three. Come back to the here and now and sensing the room around you. Four. Your eyes are beginning to open now as you wake. And five. Eyes wide open, wide awake, feeling wonderful in every way. Thank you for using Entrance.